So we're gonna be reacting to this video. It's called Men Are Simple. I'm just curious to see if this is one of those I hate men videos or just like, or not. That's really the only thing I wanna see. But if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe, comment for another one you wanna see next, man. I think society is screwed, bro. Cause there's so much men versus women. It is cook, it's over with. And then the kids that are growing up are gonna be like watching this shit. They taking in all this social media shit. Then they about to have high expectations for no reason. So I don't know, man. I'm really just inter interested to see if this is one of those men I hate men videos, but man, grab y'all popcorn in this locker. Men are simple, okay? okay? And I say this because I need to reassure myself sometimes that men are simple, okay? The main difference- Like, is that a good a thing or a bad thing? It's obviously our, our parts, but it's our hormones. And a man's hormones regenerate every 24 hours, whereas a woman's is 28 days. Yeah. Okay, we, we know this though, we know this. But one of the main factors that differentiate men and women is what we stress about. What does a man stress about and what does a woman stress about? Mm, that's Let a me good tell point. you, okay? One that's a good point. All right, we gotta see if she's about to cook. Cause I feel like women stress more about like emotional shit. They can stress about like real life shit, like logical shit that's happening, like bills and all that other shit. But I feel like they stress more about emotional shit. But I don't know, let's see. One of the main things a man stresses about when he wakes up every morning is work okay that is work no women if you're gonna tell me work is the first thing you stress about in the morning then you're you're like you're a man you're masculine you're, you're worried about the wrong things That's okay a, good point. That's a, good a man point. stresses about work the first thing he wakes up in the morning okay that's when his testosterone levels are at its rise its peak right Every morning a man wakes up. Every healthy man wakes up. Stresses about work. He gotta get it done, okay? Yeah. Women, the roof over your head was created by a man, okay? The road you're driving on, created by a man. Men are simple. They get the job done, they have to. They wake up every day stressing if they can. Women. She's cooking right now, bro, she's cooking right now. What do we stress about? What do we stress about the most, okay? What do we stress about pretty much when we wake up and then when we go to bed? Men. Men. We stress about men. Now, I'm not saying it's a bad thing because subconsciously, women are looking for their mate. We're looking for our husband, a father figure for- Yeah, it's not a bad thing. No, one thing that really, like, all right, this is, I actually want to know your opinion on this, right? If y'all were to have a daughter, obviously you want them to go through school and like get their degree and all that kind of stuff, have a good job. But at what point do you tell them to like focus more on like getting a relationship versus being like too hard work driven? Like, I don't know if that makes sense. Like, at what point do you tell your daughter like, all right, listen, you're doing really well in life, but you really got to like find a husband or something like that. Or is that even something you should say? Because obviously you want to have like grandkids, you want to grow your family and that kind of stuff. But like, how do you even go about that? Like, at what age do you switch, like shift from, all right, they got to graduate school, blah, 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 get to school, blah, 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 to all right, now you got to focus on like finding a family. For our children, you know, we have every right to stress about getting our perfect man for our family, right? That is what we are subconsciously looking for and what we're stressing about. Yeah. But what it's getting to in this day and age is that we're looking over our shoulders. We're getting, we're getting uh, jealous. We're over here like we're getting insecure over men. We're feeling empowered and above men. Like how can you, how can you stress about a man and then feel like you're better than him? That makes no sense to me. But like I said, we stress about two different things mm -hmm. on a regular basis. And a man's hormones fluctuate 24 hours compared to a woman's 28 days. It's different. She's it's so right different. Now, we right are now. not equal. We are not the same, okay? This is where I say men and women are not the same. Now, as a whole, we are not all the same. Obviously, we have different personalities. But men, women different we stress about different things the second thing a man stresses about 
every day is sex. Not women. I don't think, actually. Not women. I wouldn't say you stress about it, but I think. Why? Because men need their testosterone to be catered to. Just like how a woman needs to be loved and nurtured, right? We need to be like assured. We need to be loved and, you know, tell reassure us of our love and our beauty. You know, that's all we need as a woman. Just tell all right, us. I take it back. I take it back. back. She's cooking. She's you know cooking. what I'm saying? A man, he just needs some. He just needs some, especially in the morning. The morning is the best time to give it to him because that's when he's ready. He's ready for the day. He's ready to take on any stress he can nah, in his I work ain't gonna life. Lie. And I don't. I don't fuck with the morning, bro. Cause the morning is like it'd be too many smells in the morning but like you have you just woke up your breath smell like fucking ass and i don't know bro i don't know like right off the like right off the wake up turn around and kiss somebody talking about some good morning babe fuck no bro breath smelling like cheese and shit uh. and, and you know the relationship if you're over there like waking up in the morning questioning him already like that's how it is a man needs sex to validate himself, you know? Like, a man needs sex, straight up like that. It's simple, it's simple. It's not that he's out there looking for a better chick than you. I wonder it's what led like to her making this video. lusting over everything. It's just his testosterone tells him he needs sex in order to get the job done. Literally, that is that. And if you think it's any more than that, you're making it more complicated than it is because he's mm. a man, mm. okay? We're more complicated than that. We have hidden agendas that we don't even understand, okay? Emotional emotional intelligence is what we have, okay? And you just need to use that and actually get smart around, like, about how men are. The second thing a woman stresses about is kids, okay? We stress about our kids. We stress about emotional needs you know yeah, we might have an inner point. child in ourselves where that's where we take care of that's what we stress about right we stress about having kids we stress about our periods we stress about that that's what we stress about second to men that's different than sex sex and kids correlate but they're different right yeah. it's like the sex comes from the man and then the women brings the children and in return, she has to take care of them, you know? Like, we, we both do. Men and women take care of children. But yeah. women have this different connection with children because we literally birth them. That's why we stress about She's cooking right now. I ain't gonna lie, bro. This is not what I thought was gonna happen at all in the video. Them Because we birth them. Our umbilical cord was connected to them. Mm. That's why we stress more than men about children. But guess what? That goes to my third stress for men. So the first stress for men was work. The second stress was sex. And the third one is kids. Because, of course, a man's going to stress about his kids. He's got kids. Yeah, Those are his kids. kids. That is his yeah. seed. That is who he is. And especially if he has a boy. Now, yeah. don't, I'm not taking it away from daughters. You know, a man can love his daughter just as much as his son. But think about that. That is a second him. That is a, that is a double him. Just like Literally, if I had yeah. a daughter, it would be a double me. So... After a man stresses about his work, he got his he got his sex in, you know, he got his stuff figured out. That's when he starts figuring out, oh, what does my child need? He needs to go to a different school. He needs this for his future. What is what does my child need? She needs this. She needs to go to ballet. She, you know, she, that's when a man thinks about his children after he's already gotten everything out nah, of the now way. Now that I think that about can, it, bro, you know, put, being a parent is so crazy, bro. Cause you literally have to like put. All, like, you go to work, right? Then you got to come back to work. You got to make sure your kid does extra curricular activities. Then you got to show up to the games. Because, like, you not showing up to their games, they remember that for, like, when they grow up. And then it affects them, their confidence, and that kind of stuff. So you really got to, like, put all your stuff to the side, bro. Like, that's crazy. And you're not even really taught it. Once you have the kid, you're just, like, you just got to lock in. Damn, that's so scary, bro. Then the kids be having attitude and shit. Like, all right, bro the roof over his children's head and he can you know have his testosterone figured out because that's what a man needs a man needs his testosterone leveled in every single day every single day his testosterone levels out whereas a woman it's like once a month okay we fluctuate in 28 days and it's just it's so different like women we need to understand this and if you think you understand it you need to repeat it and repeat it again because 
you'll find yourself in a situation where you're mad at your your man for no reason. Okay? You need to understand. Nah, your one man. thing that's low key for me to eye contact, man. It's a little bit. It's like too much eye contact. It's just fucking freaking me out. And yourself. That's what it takes to be in a relationship. S straight up. And if you think you just need to understand yourself first, that's selfish. Okay. Yeah. The third thing a, a woman stresses about is her weight. Her weight. What she looks like. Oh, okay? I guess yeah. Because yeah. women, we take our beauty into the uppermost like echelon of value we value our beauty right because we age and you know when we're young that's when we're the most beautiful the most vulnerable you know that's where that's where we feel the most valued when we're young right mm. um so when while we're stressing about men and children we're also stressing about our weight and how we look and we just want to be presented in a way that our man wants us right but the thing is in order to keep your man, you need to look good. You know what I'm saying? Like you can't, you can't give up on yourself and expect yeah. your man to stay with you. You know, like even if you have. But it goes the same way for guys too. This one goes either way. I feel like these are the both the same. Cause if you were the girl, I'm realistically, if you were the girl and she gains like 500 pounds, bro, yeah, that shit gotta go. But the same way, like if you're with a guy and he gains 500 pounds, like it's the same exact thing. So. You got to maintain that same image because you work so hard to get like what makes you attracted to somebody is how you see them and the, like the personality and all that kind of stuff. But you got to maintain that. Once that starts long, like going down, interest starts going down. Yeah, like a lot of shit just starts going down. So have kids, even if you did tie the knot, even if, you know, you've been together and for audio is gone. 10 plus years, you still need to look good, not just for yourself, but for your man, because a man and for yourself too, yeah. needs sex. Okay. Not you. A man will never need you. A man will never need a woman. Just She's like a woman seen. will never need a man. Go. But the thing is, how, as how contradicting it sounds, a man built the roof over my head. So technically, a woman does need a man a little more than a man needs a woman. Just because of the fact... Engineer. You know, we both need each other. Damn. You know, we really do. But women, we need to stop being insecure over what our man thinks and how he's judging. And we just need to stop overthinking that, please. Cause men are just so simple. All you need to do is just communicate. All you need to do is work on yourself, do the things you gotta do. And that's all a man really cares about. Nah, I say he one thing care if that I, for me, I gotta work on bro, is being emotionally intelligent, bro. Like, I get told I'm not emotionally, like if I'm with a girl, and I see that she's mad. Like, I got too much shit going on. I'm not about to be sitting down and asking you, like, Hey, babe, what's going on with your date? If it's your girlfriend, that's different. But if it's just somebody that you're talking to, like, yeah. Like, I don't really got time then. Because I got to make money. I got to pay this car note. I got to, like, school fees, all of that shit. Got to go to work. Post on these YouTube videos, TikTok, blah, 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 blah. So, I don't know. But is that... That's another thing. I feel like they don't teach you that. You got to, like, you just learn it. And if you don't learn it, where do you learn it from? Like, relationship after relationship after relationship. You're richer than him. He doesn't care if you're successful. He doesn't care what you got going on. If you, you know, you're failing in something or if you don't know what... You know, being indecisive as a woman is okay. But if you're going to sit there and play victim to everything in your in your life, like, a man doesn't want to, like, stress about that. He already stresses about work. Work is the first thing he stresses about. And if he's not stressing about work, then he's probably playing around and he's freaking around because he's stressing about sex. Okay? So to know you have a good man in your life is to know that he is stressing about these three things in the correct order. Mm. Work, sex, kids. That is the correct the order that a man she said is stresses in, in about. The correct order. Okay? And I don't know. I just... I'm not saying I'm professional here. I'm just saying I have experience and I need to reassure myself as a woman because I don't want to play victim. I don't want to act like I'm better than men and I don't want to act like I'm better than any other woman because I'm humbly myself. I am myself and I learned a lot of a lot of different things in this life of, about hormones and how we react to certain situations and men and women are so different. We're so different. Especially yeah, when we wake up in the morning, difference. men are so different than women. Like, <laughs> I, I swear, there's a lot of women out there that yeah, are- Like, it's so different, bro. It's so different. It's so different. All right, let's see. Okay, but I'm talking hormone-wise. 
Men do not stress about the sh stuff we stress about. They don't. They don't care. Yeah, like it's, I don't know, it's like two different like worlds. But I feel like it's just because you have more expectations. Like even think about it like this. If there's a broke female and a broke girl, like a broke man and a broke like woman. Like, all right, think about it like this. Let's say the wife in their relationship was broke and the man is taking care of everything. That's like, it's, it's, it's not as bad as if the wife was the breadwinner and then the man is like riding her curtain tail. I wouldn't say riding her curtain tail, but like the man is just, I don't know, like not being a man, not providing. Like, what do you call a man that's not providing at all?